With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. So in this question, we have to prove the following points are collinear using vector method. Okay. So this is our A point and the position vector for A point will be so x coordinate is 2 so this will be 2y cap and y coordinate is minus 1 so this will be minus of j cap and z coordinate is 3 so this will be plus 3k cap okay similarly the position vector of b will be 4i cap plus 3j cap plus k cap and position vector c will be that is of point c so this will be 3i cap plus j cap plus 2k cap okay so the position this is the position vector of point b this is the position vector of point c and this is the position vector of point a okay so here we'll be determining a b vector and b c vector and we'll be checking whether these two vectors are parallel or not okay so a b vector can be written as position vector b minus position vector a so this is equals to now 4 i cap minus 2 i cap is 2 i cap 3 j cap minus of minus j cap so this will be plus 4 j cap now k cap minus 3 k cap so this will be minus of 2 k cap okay now b c vector can be written as position vector c minus position vector b so this is equals to now 3 i cap minus 4 i cap so this will be minus of i cap now j cap minus 3 j cap so this will be minus of 2 j cap okay now 2 k cap minus k cap so this will be plus of k cap so let us write this vector in terms of bc vector okay so this will be equal to now if i take minus 2 common from here so this will be minus 2 into okay minus i cap okay minus of 2 j cap plus k cap so here you can see that this is our bc vector so this is equals to minus 2 times of bc vector so that means we can write ab vector as minus 2 times of bc vector okay now basically two vectors say a vector and b vector are said to be parallel if they satisfy the condition that is a vector is lambda times of b vector in which lambda is scalar so here you can see that minus 2 is a scalar okay is a scalar quantity minus 2 is a scalar quantity okay so that means a b vector a b vector and b c vector are parallel so i can write a b vector is parallel to b c vector okay so so this is our a b vector okay this is our a b vector and b c vector will be this is our b c vector so here these two vectors are parallel but you can see that the point b are common to both so that means a b c points are collinear and this completes our solution for class 6 to 12 itj and neat level Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.